Hey Colette's up, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond. I am here tonight for another one of my general readings for the overall collective. Um, this is going to kind of be like one of my whatever comes out reading for you all. These messages can apply to anyone of any zodiac sign, um, as well as these messages may apply to your past, your present, or your future. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. And without any further ado, we are going to jump into tonight's messages. Okay, collective. So... Um, I've already pre-shuffled your oracles and uh, clarifiers for the oracles, okay? Um, then I'm going to pull on the tarot for you all to get you some further clarification. Um, and if we need to get any other messages, then we'll do so at that time, guys, okay? So, let's see what's going on. Okay, guys. Uh, well, first of all, guys, I mean, <laughs> I am so tired. Y'all don't even understand, y'all. I am, um, I am so tired of all the negative energy. You don't even understand. Um. I, you know, I am tired of this energy. I'm tired of the negative energy. Um, but, I mean, here we are once again, honey. So, we're going to get, get into it. Somebody needs to hear this. And I'm going to relay these messages for you, okay? Um, okay, I'm just pulling you a few extra clarifiers right now. And then we're going to um, we're going to get into these messages, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. First of all, the first overall um, message we have here is dreams. Okay, um, I feel like uh, collective. There are. I don't, this is going to be a very direct message for a specific person. So let me first of all say that. However, guys, I feel like there are uh, some of you who are having some very lucid dreams, okay? Um, your dreams are very vivid, um, okay? I feel like you are seeing signs and synchronicities within your dreams, Um because of the things that's going on around you, okay? Uh, these dreams, I feel like for someone has become overwhelming, okay? Um, but I feel like these dreams are, 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 are more like uh, being haunted and taunted. These are not your, um, your uh, average dreams, okay? Okay. Um, But somebody is definitely, and, and, and it's like, it's not just when these individuals can go to sleep and they're dreaming. Um, th this is happening during that time. But I feel like even throughout the day, these individuals are being haunted and taunted by visions, um, by demonic forces, by entities, by deities, um, by different things that's plaguing them right now because of of uh, sinister things that they have partook in, okay? The next overall clarifier we have here are uh, is gray, okay? The overall message is gray, but it says endings are inevitable, okay? So I definitely feel like that something is coming to an end, okay? I, I definitely feel like... Um, there's going to be some type of major shakeup, some major upheaval pertaining to a situation. These individuals who are a part of this, um, these 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 individuals who are a part of this, they're the ones who are being haunted and taunted by these dreams, by these visions. Okay, um, 
and I literally feel like many of these individuals um, are under demonic possession, okay? Or they're definitely under demonic possession of some type. Okay, guys, so let's just get into these messages, okay? So I clarify dreams and I have hole in the soul. These individuals have sold their soul to the devil. They have made conscientious decision to sell their souls to the devil. Thus, they are soulless beings. Um, these individuals um, are a part of secret societies, okay? But I feel like these are um, like... Um, lower level secret societies, underground secret societies that um, uh, uh, are more along the level of satanic cults, witch covens and, and things like that, okay? These people partake in um, ritualistic practices, okay? Um, from uh, sex magic, um, they do all kinds of spells and curses, they're into black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, hexes, curses, root work, and all kinds of evil, malicious things that they use to attack others in order to get what they want, okay? These individuals are also a part of um, a group of gang stalkers, okay? These are the very individuals who are recruited um, to be gang stalkers, okay, who are literally assigned to certain persons to stalk them, harass them, invade them, violate them, um, maliciously attack them in many different ways. If you look at this card, okay, these people are very dark, sinister, and demonic, okay? Um, they partake in many different rituals, one of which are blood rituals. Now, um, where they drink bodily fluids like blood, um, as, as well as other bodily fluids. Okay. These people also, uh, partake in, you know, they have their sex rings as well. So they partake in illicit sex rituals as well, um, in order to conjure up and manifest the things that they want. Okay. There are some, the endings are in, um, inevitable with these individuals, okay? And they're being haunted and taunted in their dreams by this, okay? They can sense this. Their spells and their curses have backfired on them, okay? And they are being haunted by the very demons that they have conjured up. These people are soulless beings. Thus is the reason why they have a hole in their, their soul, okay? You see this demonic figure that this individual conjured up, okay? They're they're all in their head. They're being haunted and taunted by these demons as well as they are being controlled by the higher forces that they have sold out to, Um uh, these are people because they, these are lower level individuals. There are people who are their handlers, um, who basically controls any and everything that they do, that they say and, and, and everything. Okay. Yeah. These individuals are witches. Okay. But I do feel we have witch here. Okay. These individuals are witches. Okay. Um, however, I do feel like the individuals that they have been working against, there is justice coming um, for those particular persons, okay, um, that they have been doing these very sinister evil things onto. And they know this, okay, this is the reason why they are being plagued with these dreams, okay, um, and they know these endings are coming. These catastrophic events are coming, okay? These people um, did um, what they they did onto this person, okay? In order to conjure up something in particular that they wanted. These people partook in some very sinister, malicious, and evil, even, excuse me, illegal things in order to get what they want, okay? And it all resulted around um, uh, possessions, materialisms. This is about greed, okay? So we're talking about finances, money, resources, property, possessions, okay? Is what these people were looking for 
for the incentives. What does is the reason why they so viciously attacked certain persons, which is the reason why um, these individuals and they stopped at nothing. They did black magic and voodoo on a person. They targeted a person. They falsified documentations, informations, even lied on a person to, to, to try to set them up, to hurt them, to harm them in any way that they so possibly can. And, and, and while they were in the process of casting these curses and casting these spells and throwing all the, uh, these obstacles in this person's way that they were working against, they set an expectation waiting um, for this abundance to come in for them, for this harvest to come in for them, which is what they were conjuring up, which was uh, the main reasoning for the manipulation, okay? I do feel like that there is a mature man who is involved in this situation, okay? Um this mature man uh, was in conjunction with these individuals. This mature man may have even been in control of them. Thus, their handler told him what to do, how to do, when to do, and everything, okay? Um, and, and, and what these people partook in, like I said, they did everything that they did because they were expecting this great fortune, okay? They figured by doing their black magic and their voodoo by casting their curses and their spells um by their intimidation tactics and their manipulations and things that they were going to get this great fortune and they set an expectation of this okay because they had this mature man whom they were they they were working for or sold out to who was assisting them helping them in some type of way thus they thought that they could not lose okay i am talking about a group of people okay a large amount of people guys okay we're talking about a family of individuals that came together to do these malicious demonic satanic sinister evil wicked things unto another just for them to get what they want and they stopped at nothing to do it these people are thieves spirit is saying they stopped at nothing to get this great fortune here okay i told you in order to steal something that was that rightfully belonged to someone else these individuals falsified documentations stole one's uh, uh, identity even created a doppelganger uh, found a look-alike doppelganger to to act like the person that they were trying to get over in order to to um, steal this great fortune from the person that it, it rightfully belonged to. Okay? Spirit is saying that these people are thieves. They also did black magic and voodoo on this person. They sent evil forces, demonic forces to this person. What they did not know is the person in, in, in which that they were, were attacking was an angelic being who was protected by the divine, a chosen one. Thus, all their black magic, their voodoo, their hoodoo, their hexes, their curses, their spells backfired and reversed on them. Now they are paying the consequences for what they have done. It is known that they falsified documentation and tried to steal this great fortune. It is known about the doppelganger and the lookalike, the lies, the deceptions, the manipulations, the trickery, the fuckery. It is known about by legal representation authority figures. It is known. They have been watched, surveillanced. While they were surveillancing this other people, invading and violating the human rights, the privacy, the personal space, the constitutional rights, the civil rights of another, just so that they can steal someone else's great fortune. 
They were being surveillance. They were being watched. They dropped the ball. They slipped up. Their covers have been blown. And now that they have been exposed as witches, as Satanists, as sellouts, they've exposed their family, their friends. They have exposed even uh, those of them in authority and a power whom they are sold out to. They expose even the satanic powers that be. They have uh, 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 exposed their own hoods, their own neighborhoods, their own communities in which they had their mask on. And they paraded around amongst other people who had no idea that these individuals were like this had no idea that these individuals were into black magic and voodoo had no idea that these people were in secret societies witch covens sex rings prostitution rings human trafficking rings satanic cults had no idea that they partook in in in, in blood sacrifices and ritualistic practices oh yes even they tried to put a hit out to kill, they stopped at nothing to steal this great fortune. Now, those demons are hunting them. They have a hole in the soul because they sold their soul. Many of them are sitting in bad health right now because of what they have done. Okay? Many of them are sick. Their relationships are falling apart. Many of them are, are facing imprisonment. For what they have done. Because they tried to steal this great fortune. Because they stole property. Because they stole money. Many of them. Will be plagued with death. Will be faced with death. And as well as they have received. Messages of concern. Already pertaining to this. You see because these individuals were warned. They were warned to stop doing what they were doing, but they refused. Part of the part of which why they refuse to stop doing what they're doing is just because of the simple fact that they are demonically possessed, and demons have have inhabited their body. So these demons control their mind, their and their body. But also because of the simple fact that they are under contract, because they sold out for material gain see they are these these satanic occults these secret societies that they in is run ruled and controlled by the satanic powers that be and these satanic powers that be they run rule and control a lot of things on this here earth so these people are bound under contract so they couldn't stop if they wanted to but they got themselves ca caught up. And these demons, those, 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 those um, spells and curses has backfired on them. And they're suffering from it. Some of them are suffering from, from, from bad health, like I said. Some of them are facing jail time because it has been exposed. The legal crimes that they have committed. See, it has been found out about like, you know, this is not just finding out that a group of people are doing black magic and voodoo on people. See, what people don't know is that is, that is going on the books. People are getting ready to start being prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law for casting, for doing black magic and voodoo and root work curses and spells on people that is causing because those things are done to cause people death, harm, destruction, mental illness, to lose finances, money, resources, stability, security, mainly death. We're technically talking about premeditated murder here. When one is doing black magic or voodoo onto a person in an effort to hurt them and harm them, to cause them bodily injury, sickness, illness of some kind, it's the same thing as somebody pulling a gun on you and blowing your head off. It's premeditated murder. And this is what these people have been doing. And it has been found out about. I mean, they even went as far as to try to hire hitmen to kill a person. 
and they falsified documentation and they stole this person's identity and they came up with an adopaganga and they committed all kinds of crimes in the process. Okay, they broke uh, 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 legal laws, biblical laws. They broke laws against humanity. This is a hate crime. You understand? These are terroristic acts. You understand? That these people partook in a whole family of individuals. Working against someone who is also supposedly, allegedly supposed to be their family as well. I've never seen such levels of disloyalty a day before in my life. I mean, we have cartels out here. You know, we have the, the real OGs. There's a lot of folks out here think they gang banging and slanging and things, but we got real OGs out here who are mobsters. They ain't going to play with nobody. I have not ever seen such disloyalty with those people amongst their own kind and their own families. I've, I've never seen such disloyalty amongst the cartels in their own family in that way. Hell, even the, 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 the white people elite wealthy white people in power i have never even seen such disloyalty in this manner amongst their kind but this is a whole family of individuals and don't get me wrong because when i say that they are sold out to the satanic powers that be see now you are implementing even other people of other races who are who uh, who are directly involved in this as well as indirectly involved in this. Who aren't necessarily a part of this family. But because these individuals are sellouts, they are working for higher powers that be. But you know the, the powers that be, they play their role. On the surface, it seems as if they have their hands clean. They don't have nothing to do with nothing. They don't know anything about nothing. But there is nothing that's anything that goes on in this world that the government and the powers that be don't know about it, baby. And if you don't know nothing about it, you better ask somebody about it. See, this is the reason why they recruit these puppets. Because it's all they got, they puppets on the string. And the powers that be, they say kinds of things and they pulls the strings of these puppets on a low level that they get to do the dirty work. But, but, but this disloyalty, this is disloyalty from people who are being disloyal and betraying an individual of their own kind. You see. And they did all of this and they literally sat back in expectation waiting on this great fortune because they thought that because of whatever type of witchery power they think that they got, you know, I, I, I don't know what, you know, what, what, what rock they slipped and fell and hit the head on, but they, I mean, there are way more powerful witches in the world. It was a, it's been a whole slew of witches that came well to hell before them. But whatever made them believe that they were such guru, supernatural, all-powerful witches to do what they done to the magnitude in which they done it, these these fools so stone cold crazy. They are they mind. You know, it's one thing for you to say, oh, I don't like somebody, I'm going to cast a spell on. You know, you a regular person and the person you dislike and you're working against is a regular person. It's not right. These individuals went through such great lengths to get over. These people tried to defraud insurance companies. The government in itself, 
going as far to bribe officers of the law, going as far to do even black magic and voodoo on judges and lawyers and things to prolong this situation to keep the person that they were trying to block from getting this that, that this great fortune rightfully went to they, they be crazy when you get to bribing cops and, and, and casting curses and spells on government officials and authority figures and honorable sitting judges you are smooth crazy out your mind you just you just need a padded room okay and a straight jacket and some medication yeah because ain't no help for you you got to be out your mind. It's the only logical explanation. You know? I mean, I, I, I feel like this is worse than, than purging yourself in a court of law. You purge yourself in a court of law. This is just you going in, 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 in court, you know, under oath and lying. And hoping to get away with it. But when you think you so about it, your witcher is so strong. That you can go in here and cast curses and spells on judges and lawyers. And you can you can bribe cops with, you know, try to find dirty cops that you can bribe with sex or money or whatever. You stone cold crazy than hell. Period. Just period. This is what these people did. I mean, they stopped at nothing. And they literally thought that because of the fact that they was doing all of this. And they got a scene and clicks with one another to make all of this happen to, to, to pop all of this off and the fact that they was was so out they they are part of the secret societies and they are part of the you know the underground rings and things and they are part of the witch covens and things and they they under contract they just sold it so they just knew that they was protected but I don't give a damn what you sold out to the powers that be will see your ass fall before the hell they fall for any damn thing and you can even be working for them so I clarified hole in the soul we have the message here I lost myself for a while these people smooth lost they said they did lose they said. these people addicted to drugs they're addicted to alcohol. They're addicted to sex. They're addicted to greed and money. This is this 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 was the power and the motivation and behind everything that they did. Yeah. And they lost themselves. They got lost in the sauce and everything that they was doing. And now they're being hunted and taunted by the very demons that they conjured up. Because they conjured up, they silly asses conjured up demons against a chosen one. And them demons didn't even touch that person and turned around and came back to them. How many of you know that the curses were reversed? See, this is why I'm playing with dark dark magic. See, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't do that. I could and I would be very powerful at it. But I don't I don't I don't I don't play with the dead. I don't play with demons. Hell, I don't play with Lucifer. See, thus I don't fear these entities and they I know that they have no reason to attack me personally. See, demonic forces work through individuals who invite them in, who conjure them up. Who call upon them and allow them to, to inhabit their body and work through them. Yeah. This is the reason. This is how we're even able. It, it is even possible to have demons in the flesh. Okay. Because demons are spirits. They need a vessel though. They need a body. You conjure these demons up by name, baby, and they coming. You take your soul. That's why these people got holes in the soul. They being hunted and taunted by them demons that they conjured up and all that black magic and flipped on them. All that voodoo, hoodoo, and then flipped on them, came back on them. Yeah, they lost themselves. They got lost in it. They couldn't even stop doing it. They got, they got obsessed. 
I mean, I'm talking about it spell after spell. We ain't talking about one spell. I'm talking about they were doing binding spells, beauty spells, glamour spells. Spells on the mind, spells on the body, spells on the finances, spells on one's love life, spells on one's wound. Spells on one's mental stability. Spells on one's children. I mean, all kind of love spells, sex spells, magic spells, all kinds of things. They couldn't stop. They lost themselves for a while. And Spirit is coming through and telling you, telling y'all, you should have made better fucking choices. Spirit is telling you, if you are pissed off at where you are, then stop taking, uh, uh, stop taking yourself there. Yeah, you took yourself there. Yeah. Make better fucking choices. If you're pissed off at where you are in life, you pissed off about this black magic, this voodoo reversion on you, then you put, you shouldn't be. That's a telltale sign that you shouldn't be doing black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, hexes, curses, and spells on no damn body else. You pissed off that, that, that you can't get a good night's sleep and you being hunted and taunted by demons and shit. Then it's probably because you shouldn't have never conjured them up in the first place. Now you worried and scared because the grim reaper have come to collect and the satanic powers that be is on your ass like white on rice like a white paper plate in a snowstorm and you scared to damn death. But maybe you should have thought of that before you sold your soul to sign the contract. Make better fucking choices. Nah, but all you was worried about was money. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Spirits say these people are in this energy here. It was my fault, but I blamed you. They know it was their fault. They know everything that they done is their fault. And they try to lie. They got their fly monkeys to lie and spread gossip, rumors, lies. On the person that they was working against when they knew it was their fault. When they knew what they had done. Now they got a feeling that they just can't shake. Because this shit has come, has come back to haunt them. Spirit, the spirit is saying that little voice inside your head, them demons that's talking to you, listen to that shit. Because you conjured it up. It's their fault. But they tried to blame the very person that they was working against. The very person that they was hurting, that they was harming, that they was attacking. Now, you got a feeling. Spirits say, listen to that shit. That little voice, that little demon that's inside your head, listen to that shit. Yeah, I ain't making it up. It's on the card. Yeah. These people hid behind material things. I told you, they did this for great fortune. They did this for incentives. They hid behind material things. That's all they're about. Money. You see them dollar signs there? Money. That's all they're seeing. Yeah. Money. They round here stunned in front. They want to make it rain. They was literally riddling to take somebody else's life away from them. To keep them from having this money. Take what was rightfully belonged to some damn body else. And then they want to run around town and make it rain. And make it seem like they high and mighty. They righteous and upstanding. I don't know how they sleep at night in the first damn place. Yeah. They hid behind material things, Spirit of Sin. Mm -hmm. Spirit is saying that these people's life is not together as it seems. See, on the forefront, these people may walk around like they 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 righteous and they upstand and they pillars of the community. Some of them may walk around here like they saved, sanctified, holy, and delivered. 
when they know they the soul, they soul and they ass to the devil. When they know they are part of secret societies and witch covens. How you righteous when you a sellout? How you righteous when you doing black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, hexes and curses and spells on people? How you righteous when you hiring hitmen to try to take people's lives? How you righteous uh, 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 doing black magic and voodoo on people's children? How you righteous targeting somebody? How you righteous invading and violating somebody's privacy? How you righteous maliciously stripping a person away from their human rights, their civil, their constitutional rights. Who the hell is you to even do that? How are you righteous? These people's life is not together as it seems. Yeah, and they come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. Mm -hmm. I don't care what they looking like. Some of them might look good. Some of them might smell good. A few of them might dress good. Their life ain't as together as it seems. Okay? Yeah. And these people broke the person's heart. They broke their family member's heart that they was working against. They broke that person's heart. But you know what? Spirits say, fuck them. Cut them off with their own sword. Fuck them. And keep it moving. Yeah. See, now I, 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 I feel like another another reason that they're being haunted and taunted with, uh, to clarify this, these, these endings are inevitable here. They ain't got the, these messages of concern. These messages, these news, this information, communication that came in to them. Found it out the truth, crushed them. Now they're being haunted. They're being taunted. Found it out that 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 uh 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 what they were doing has been found out about, and a uh, and and in proper authorities know about. They're being watched by the feds. Finding out the truth, crushed them. Finding out they wouldn't they weren't able to maliciously get over. And 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 take. Was a, uh, uh, that which wasn't theirs in the first place. Oh, it crushed them. Yeah. And spirits say you going through some. They going through some shit now. They going through some shit. Spirits say everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up. And deal with it. Handle it. That's what the message say. I didn't make it up. I know somebody sitting here listening to this. I'm like, oh, how dare she say this? How dare? It's on the cards, baby. That's the truth. That's the truth. This is this 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 is this is what's going on. Yeah. And see, the person that they jealousy they jealous of, they envious of, that they so hateful towards. They know that this person is 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 talented and fucking amazing, Spirit says. This person is a chosen one that they worked against. This person is aligned, is one with the divine. Spirit say the world needs this person's power. The world needs this person to use their voice. They made this person feel like that they were not loved. But that's okay because there's somebody somewhere where this person is coming to contact with them or not and, 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 and they are loved. These these people that they worked in, they worked against the person that made them feel unloved. See, they this person's own family betrayed them. Ultimate betrayal. Ultimate betrayal. Made them feel like they wasn't worthy, that they wasn't loved. But they are. You know why? Because they love themselves. They mad because this person is winning. They mad because this person is a winner. 
Spirit is saying also that this person is loved by God. This person loves themselves. This person is loved by spirit, by angelic forces. Okay? Because Spirit is saying that this person is here for a reason. And it's their life purpose not to fuck up. Not to fuck it up. Not to fuck up that reason. Excuse my language if you can't handle it. Click off. They mad. They jealous. They envious. They didn't want this person to win, but they win it. Spirits say that this person got a good thing going and they didn't like it. They was trying to ruin that shit for them. Let's clarify. Okay, guys. These people are juggling. Are they feeling some type of way because they like they lack of finances, money, and resources, and they juggling right now? Okay, with the two of coins there, they juggling amongst all of them. They juggling this two of coins. They feeling some type of way because what 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 they thought they was going to get, what was promised to them, and and everything. Because you know, each and every one of that they got on board, they recruited, they they could uh uh that they uh uh uh. uh coerce and per to partaking in this they offered them something to do so yeah but they juggling they lack of finances money and resources this is the reason why they all up in their head they see they've been sitting in expectation for a long time for this great fortune coming to them and they was just gonna say you know they was just gonna crap on this person they was working against Oh, they was going to throw them a whole party and everything and turn up. Why this person they wanted to see this person suffer in misery and agony with nothing them and their child if they had children. Could you imagine your entire family working against you like that? Your mother's side and your daddy's side and complete strangers. And they linked up. They said, you come to find out, they sell out and linked up with folks in power. Sabotaging you like that? Could you imagine? These folks juggling now. Why? Because they they was in competition with this person. The person that they was working against, they was jealous of, they was envious of, and this is the reason why they was hating on them. Yeah. A lot of competition going on. They even, they, these people so ignorant, they even got competition amongst those of them. See, it's a whole team of them. A whole slew of them that worked against a specific individual doing all of these things but it's even competition amongst them they come they came together to work against this other person that they in competition with but they are competing with each other even it's a damn shame spirit say it's a damn shame yeah now they sitting here with these burdens see the the, the very burdens that they tried to put on the person that they was working against they the ones sitting here with all these burdens now because it is leaked it's been exposed. It's been found out what they was about, what they was doing, what they had going on. The evil, wicked, malicious things that they was doing, that they had planned. Now they sitting here with all these burdens, with all these problematic situations, with all these uh, 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 different issues and different things to handle, to ha uh, that, that's going on. Yeah. That's that the Ten of Wands. That Three of Cups here, I told you, it's a whole group of them. It's more than three people. It's a whole family of them. A whole group of them that came together and do this. Okay? And they're the, these witches are amongst them. It's certain ones. It's a whole group of them that came together. But it's certain ones of them that call themselves being like witch practitioners. They even hired higher uh, ranking witch practitioners that um, to do certain curses and spells against this person, honey. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But see, this wheel of fortune is turning, and it's not turning in their favor. This wheel is turning. It's no longer stuck and stagnant how they had it, because for the longest, they had procrastinated the situation. They tried to drag it out as long as they possibly could. And see, this is the reason why they thought the person they was working against was going to succumb to the black magic and the voodoo, was going to be dead and gone by now, or they was 
You're going to set them up to try to get them institutionalized or, or locked up in some type of way or something. They was going to be out the way so they could just take it all for themselves. But see, time's up. Okay? And this wheel is turning. And it ain't turning in their favor. The very person that they've been working against, justice will be served. Justice is coming in for that person. And I feel like they just got these messages. They just found out that things did not go in their favor. That's the reason why we have endings are inedible here. Yeah. Now they're sitting in mental conflict. Why they juggling? They sitting in mental conflict. That's where the dreams come from. And the whole and the soul come from. These witches. They in mental conflict now. They being hunted and taunted and harassed by them demons that they conjured up. They got paranormal activity going on in the house. They can't sleep. They can't eat. They can't think. They stress. They got anxiety. They depressed. They anxious. They in mental conflict. Why they juggling? Yeah. Why? Because all of them that was in competition, that worked against this person that they all teamed up against so maliciously, they know this thing has come to an end. This cycle has come to an end with the world here. This cycle is complete and it has come to an end. And they know it. Yeah. Yeah. Now they say the five of cups here sitting on the center of wands, they say Sadness because of this loss of something that wasn't even theirs to begin with. Sadness because they weren't successful with killing this person. Sadness because they weren't successful with harming this person's child. Sadness because they weren't successful with stopping and blocking and knocking down another human being that's supposed to be their own family. This is sad. These people not sad or sorry for what they done. They sad and sorry because they got caught. They sad and sorry because things didn't go their way the way they set it up. That's why they sad. They ain't sad because of what they did. They would do it again if they thought it would work for them. Yeah. Now these witches. Now those in competition with this person, they reflecting back, they looking back over this, they thinking about what they done, man. Because they in mental conflict. Now they thinking about it's going, it's playing over and over and over and over again in the head. How many curses and spells they cast on this person and their child. How they done malicious things to cause this person, to make this person's life a living hell. They're thinking about them documents they falsified. They're thinking about the doppelganger. They're thinking about all the illegal crimes. They're thinking about how they lied in a court of law. They're thinking about uh, 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 how they uh, um, uh, uh, even tried to bribe police officers. And even try to, and, and even committed murder, blood sacrifices of other people. Even how they tried to get over on the judge. Yeah. Yeah. And, and and because this will is turning now, I told you they didn't receive these messages. With the eight of ones here, that fast communication came into them. They found out that that that, that this ruling or whatever, because I feel like there was a court matter, okay? I feel like there was some type of uh uh um legal decision. Maybe about an insurance and uh, an inheritance, a uh, uh, um, a will or something. Yeah, they ain't got this 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 these messages, fast communication that this will is turning, honey. But it ain't, they they just found out it didn't turn in their favor, and this is the reason why they're feeling some type of way. Okay, yeah, yeah. Now major change is coming in for them here with the Eight of Cups. There's a major shift, major change that is coming in because they're juggling their finances. they already in mental uh, uh, conflict about this because they know this change is coming. This major shift, this major change is coming. Here. Yeah. 
and all the things that they did to be in competition with this other person because this cycle has ended and 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 uh uh this whole thing is coming to an end what they have done they heart they in they heart they heartbroken now okay forget the heartbreak that they caused the person that they was working against forget the sadness in the misery that they caused the, the person that they was working against. They sitting up sad and heartbroken. Because this has, has come to an end and it didn't go in their favor. These people crazy. They stone cold crazy. Yeah. Yeah. See, these burdens that's on them, this responsibility, these problematic situations that they're dealing with here, and they in sadness because it, 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 it got found out about the lying, the cheating, the, the, the stealing. What they stole. We had the thief car come out. What they stole. That's what they really feeling some type of way about. They don't be more care nothing about it than the man on the Oh man, that was our family member. We shouldn't have done that. You know, these people I guarantee ain't repented for their sins, no none of that. They ain't gonna do none of that any darn way because they sold the soul. You can't sell your soul to the devil and then call upon God when it's convenient for you. Either you fuck God all the time, the good times and the bad times, or you are not. What you cannot do is flip-flop. You a soul is being, you sold your soul, you acting up a soul. You don't even have a soul. You might as well keep praying to Lucifer like you've been doing. Yeah, but see, it, it, it's found out about this is the reason why they in this burden energy, this sad energy, because this lying, this cheating, this stealing, this manipulating, this 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 con artistry. Yeah, this sneaking and creeping, trying to get away with something, with what they've done. The family. Yeah. Yeah, and see, all of them that's in this partnership together, they... <laughs> All of them was in this partnership together. They all reflecting back. And, and, and this is the reason why it's, it's competition and conflict even with them. It's all kind of fighting, fussing, and cussing, and arguing going on amongst them. Now, who did what? And when? And where? And how? And who need to do this? And who need to stop that? See, now they arguing different things amongst themselves. These people are mentally... Imbalance. They smooth out their mind. I'm trying to tell you. But they've been in partnership with each other all along. To do this. Yeah. They feel in some type of way because this wheel is turning. They got the messages, the fast communication, the information that this wheel is turning. That they no longer can hold this situation. It's no longer going to be stuck. It's no longer going to be stagnant. That the right for owner, you know, the, the lies and the deception has been found out about. There's been truth and clarity in this situation and everything that went on. Because I believe it was a whole investigation into this behind the scene. Yeah. And so now this growth and this moving forward. Okay. This is the reason why they're feeling some type of way here. Yeah. But see, all of this is going on. All of this is going down, guys. Because of the decision that they made. Yeah. Because the decision that they came together and made to, to be in this magician energy here, to do this black magic and this voodoo, to, to, to use the tools that they had to sneak and creep around and lie and cheat and steal and manipulate and target a person. And try to hurt and harm a person. And any and everything they could possibly do to try to get away with what with what they wanted to do. See, they made the decision to do this black magic, to do this voodoo, to do these malicious evil things. Yeah. To someone who is a higher fan. Okay. Yeah. I feel like there's even someone. I, I, I feel like there's even other people, um, some of these individuals who are involved in this, maybe a minister or pastor of some kind in this person's family. 
Someone who who was who has been ordained. Or someone who works in government. This person could have uh, that they was working against. They could have somebody, people in their family who are a part of secret societies like Freemasonry or, or Eastern Stars or uh, people in their family who like are in the military or worked for the government or in law enforcement. All them people are involved with this whole thing that went on. And it's been found out about. Yeah. It's the, this 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 ultimate betrayal has been found out about here with this with this uh with this ten of swords. It is it is known that they came together in competition against this person to work against this person for this ultimate to cut to ultimately betray them they wanted to kill this person in order to obtain this great fortune and it has been found out about yeah and see they mad as hell because this wheel is turning honey they ain't got the messages the news that there's that, 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 that money that, 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 that there's growth and there's movement forward pertaining to this large lump sum of money here this ten of coins honey and it ain't going to them and they mad as hell and this is the reason why they're in conflict now with the five of swords at the bottom of the deck. They fighting, fussing, and cussing with each other now. They in competition with each other now, okay? Yeah. Some of them trying to take off and leave. Some of them trying, they trying to flee. They trying to go on the run because they know that it has been found out what they have done. And there's conflict amongst them. Some of them about to go on the run or already have went on the run. Somebody's supposed to try to get overseas, go overseas or, or go somewhere uh, where they think they can't be extradited from or something like that. Some of them uh, are about to be apprehended and go to jail as well. Yeah, because of these secrets, these lies, these deceptions and different things. Yeah, because there's going to be justice in the situation here. Yeah. The eight of the, the eight of swords here, the five coins that somebody is going to jail behind what they did. Because see they, just, they weren't just disloyal and betrayed uh one of their family members on some malicious shit. They tried to defraud the justice system. You fucking with federal money. You got that's another thing that makes them stupid as hell. When you play, I don't, you need, look, let me tell you something. <laughs> you can act a fool if you want to. You can be a fool if you want to. But you better not be no damn fool. I, 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 I don't, I don't, look. You got career criminals around here that's got better sense than mess with federal money. You understand? That's got better sense to try to defraud the justice system, the government. These people stone cold crazy in more ways than one. They ain't they they, they and they still in competition and conflict. That's it. That's all. That's the truth. Dot com. This concludes your messages for tonight, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe if you would be so kind to. For those of you who would like to contact me, you can do so at TiffanyZiggler60 at gmail.com or at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. If you prefer to contact me by phone, you can do so at 501-478-8035. For those of you who are feeling generous and you would like to donate to the channel, it is greatly, greatly appreciated. All proceeds will um, go um, towards this channel and it would enable me to help and to heal as many people as I so possibly can uh, I do thank you in advance okay you can donate through cash app which is dollar sign tip diamond 36 or um, through PayPal which is paypal.me slash at 36 diamond y'all remember what I tell you honey there is wickedness in high places because this is a wicked wicked world that we live in honey and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner even in a neighborhood near you y'all better watch your surroundings and watch the company you keep watch the surroundings and the company in which your children are in as well and consider the fact that you never know when somebody may betray you or backstab you like your family, you better keep some protection on you, okay? Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared. Because if you stay ready, 
You ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God.